Sean Diddy Combs facing 120 new sexual assault allegations. Over 3,000 people have reportedly contacted attorney Tony Busby with claims against the rapper. Music mogul Sean Diddy Combs is confronting a wave of fresh accusations as a prominent attorney prepares to file lawsuits on behalf of 120 individuals alleging sexual misconduct spanning over two decades. This development adds to the mounting legal troubles for the hip-hop star, who is currently incarcerated on federal charges. In a recent press conference, Texas-based lawyer Tony Busby revealed the scope of the impending legal action against Combs. We will expose the enablers who enabled this conduct behind closed doors. We will pursue this matter no matter who the evidence implicates, Busby declared, hinting at the involvement of other powerful figures, per NBC News. Busby outlined a range of accusations, including violent sexual assault or rape, facilitated sex with a controlled substance, dissemination of video recordings, sexual abuse of minors. The attorney's firm has reportedly been inundated with over 3,000 individuals coming forward with claims against the rapper. Perhaps most disturbing are the allegations involving minors. Busby stated that 25 of the accusers were underage at the time of the alleged incidents, with the youngest being only nine years old. When you talk about the ages of the victims when the conduct occurred, it's shocking, Busby said, according to USA Today. The demographics of the accusers show the range of Combs' alleged victims. Busby noted that 62% of the accusers identify as African American, with the majority hailing from New York, California, Georgia, and Florida. The attorney plans to initiate legal proceedings in various states within the next month. Combs' legal team has vehemently denied these allegations. His lawyer Erica Wolf stated via NBC News, as Mr. Combs' legal team has emphasized, he cannot address every meritless allegation in what has become a reckless media circus. That said, Mr. Combs emphatically and categorically denies as false and defamatory any claim that he sexually abused anyone, including minors. This latest wave of accusations comes on the heels of Combs' arrest and indictment on federal charges of sex trafficking, racketeering, and transportation to engage in prostitution. The rapper is currently detained at the Metropolitan Detention Center in Brooklyn, New York, after being denied bail twice. His legal team, which now includes high-profile attorney Alexandra Shapiro, is preparing to appeal the bail decision. The current legal storm began brewing in November 2023 when Combs' former girlfriend, singer Cassandra Cassie Ventura, filed a lawsuit accusing him of assault and sex trafficking throughout their relationship. Although Combs settled with Ventura for an undisclosed amount, subsequent months saw multiple lawsuits filed against the mogul, including one from Don Richard, a former member of the girl group Don Eddie Kane. Busby, known for his involvement in high-profile cases, has a track record of representing victims in contentious lawsuits. His past clients include those affected by the 2010 Deepwater Horizon oil spill and individuals accusing NFL quarterback Deshaun Watson of sexual misconduct. The scale of the allegations against Combs is considerable. Busby's firm claims to have amassed substantial evidence, including pictures, video, texts. The attorney warned that the names of those implicated will shock you, reported USA Today. Many of the lawsuits against Combs have been filed in New York City, taking advantage of the victims of gender-motivated violence protection law. This legislation allows individuals to file sexual abuse lawsuits even after the statute of limitations has expired.